Yo guys, what's up? This is Dave, the Oops, 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 here. And let's take a look at an Xbox module called Multi Window Sidebar. So, Multi Window Sidebar pretty much gives you a Samsung like sidebar that you find in TouchWiz ROMs. So, for example, I can pull this out right here and I have a quick selection to my favorite apps. Now, what's cool is that this actually gives you a lot of features. Open up an app, let's say Chrome, it opens in its own window. So, here's a multi window feature and then click up here for it to go away. So let's try another app. Let's try YouTube. Clicking that opens up YouTube within its own window and of course I can watch videos and just have that full capability. So customizing this is really easy. Let's go to the multi window sidebar settings and then in settings I can toggle the service starting at boot uh, app launch mode. Now right now I have set to paranoid Android Halo which gives me that nice multi window feature that you see. So opening up like tap talk gives a nice multi window. If I set it back to normal mode, what it will pretty much do is launch the app like normal. So opening up Chrome will open up the full window like we're used to. X Halo floating window and multi window. And that's for if you have those Xbox modules installed, then you can do that as well. And by the way, I am running Paranoid Android uh, ROM right now. So just in case you're wondering. Sidebar position, we can adjust it, it can be left to right. Change it to right, and I see the sidebar appears on the right. And one thing I do like is the fact that you can kind of move the indicator up and down a window, it doesn't have to just sit at one location, so I like that freedom that they give you to do that. We can change the set tab size, so I can go all the way up to 68 dp, and now it's huge. Let's turn that back down to 34. Uh, label size and animation speed. Now we can adjust the apps that come up with any quick launch by going to select apps. And here are all the apps I added, I can add a lot more apps if I wanted to, but I like these apps, and like I said it just makes it easy to open it up. And when you game, the sidebar is still visible. So as you can see down here, I still have the sidebar and I can still pull it up and I can still have quick access to these apps. So let's try open up Chrome. And what's nice within the game, it actually opens up in the side window too. So let's look at this. I'm playing Minecraft. I can quickly browse Chrome without actually leaving Minecraft. Then go back and continue playing Minecraft. And oh, wait, I'm going to go to YouTube. Let's pull that up and tap YouTube. And it's going to pull up YouTube and I can start like watching a YouTube video and go back to Minecraft. So what's nice is that in gaming this actually is very good for multitasking because you can pull something up, look at it and continue with the game that you're playing. Which is very very useful. So guys this has been a quick video on the Xbox module multi window sidebar. Like I said it's pretty cool. I'll provide a link to where you can download it. You can't find it within the Xbox gallery just yet but you can just download and install the APK from XDA and definitely think developer because it's a really cool app. So guys, as always, thanks for watching and stay tuned for another galvanizing video. Thanks.